my pudding pie. Mmm, you smell so good. Was that the door? It was broad. <laughs> hey, I went to go meet the ambulance. How, how you doing? You feeling okay? What do you think I'm doing? Just look at her. How can you ask how am I doing? I'm just wonderful. <laughs> Any pain? Mm, well, I, uh, it was my back and then that really one long contraction after that. Well, I guess it was a blessing you passed out when you did, huh? Jesse, this is the blessing. This is our blessing right here. I love you. See, Daddy? See, that's your Daddy. That's your Daddy. I don't have all the details. All I know is uh, she went into labor, and Jesse had to deliver the baby himself. Uh, I put a call into the neonatologist and Dr. Hubbard's OB. They're not in yet, so you and I are going to have to run point on this. Okay. We should go so you're prepared when Angie gets here. Yeah, glad to be. Uh, good luck, and tell her I can't wait to meet my goddaughter. Of course, of course. You know, it's weird. Sometimes it's... It's like I lost Zach yesterday. I, I wake up in the morning and I look over on his side of the bed and I expect to see him there, only he's not. And then it hits me so hard, I can barely breathe. And the other times? It feels like I lost him the day before yesterday. But tonight, it, it wasn't so fresh. Feels like maybe, slowly, it hurts less. Hey. Oh, you yeah, always got to keep things interesting, don't you? Huh? Angie? No, we have it's like to live on the edge. Mm -hmm. How are we looking? Her BP is at 90 palp, and she's diaphoretic. She's had one liter of ringer so far. Mm -hmm. And the baby. Uh, how was the Apgar? Airway was clear. Apgar on scene was 9. Good skin, turgor, and muscle tone. Heart rate 150. Respiration's 40. Impressive. Yeah. All right, we've got a deluxe suite ready and waiting. All right, let's do this, all right? Take her inside. Should I come? Uh, only if you want to see my goddaughter. Okay, you get that? Excuse me. Your hand, Angie. Okay, okay, honey. Kara, you yes, so far so good. Let's take a look. How was the, uh, how was the childbirth, Angie? Well, you'll have to ask Jesse. I passed out for most of it. Hmm. So the umbilical cord is cut. I assume the EMTs did that on the way over here? Sure. Uh, I, um, I, I handled that. Oh. Anything unusual happen, Angie, other than the obvious? Or any sensations not attributed to childbirth? Well, I was having some intense back pains in between the contractions. Uh -huh. And now? No? Do you think that you were experiencing some back labor? No, I don't think so. I had that with Frankie, and this was different. Well, I don't like the fact that you passed out, so we're going to have a full examination, okay, from head to toe. What about the baby? She looks outstanding, but obviously we'll run some tests on her. You got to leave Big Papa right about now, okay? I, I don't want. I'm, I don't, I don't, don't want to leave. Don't worry, don't worry. We're going to take very good care of your girls. I won't be far. It's okay. Examined right now, they're, they're both fine. Oh, thank God. And look at you, man, still standing. <sighs> oh, congratulations, huh? Oh. Hey. 
You haven't passed your placenta yet, but it should be any minute now. Well, I would like to take this little one down to neonatal right now, okay? No, no, no. no. Do you have to go already? I have to go because the sooner we go, the sooner we'll be back. Huh? All right, sweetheart. Yes, mm. my love. Okay. Listen, you just make sure that you take good care of her, Jake yeah, Martin. This little nugget is my goddaughter. Of course, I'm going to take yeah, care whatever. of her. Yeah, whatever. You you better. Here we go. Gosh. I miss her already. This must be Ellie. Hey, She's amazing. Sis. We would love to stay and chat with everybody. We really would, but we have some tests to ace. Uh, I'm going to go with you, okay? Uh, what, give her all the answers? I don't think so. Yeah, okay, plus by the time you scrub in, they'll already be done. Tell them, will you? Okay, we'll see in a little bit. you what it was like bringing your own kid into the world oh my god it's something i will never forget yeah oh by the way i gotta contact natalia oh uh, well make sure you call brock because he's gonna want to know too. Uh, he already knows how he heard my um call for help over the radio and he came to help oh okay well where is he it, he went back on duty oh well he couldn't have contacted natalia she would have hit me like 10 minutes ago i'm gonna make that happen i'll be back okay sure. I can stay with you until somebody gets home. No offense, you still look a little shaky. I'm not gonna operate any heavy machinery. Just a TV. No, please. Okay. Um, I work for Jared Chandler. He's kind of a big cheese here in town. So, if you need something, anything, When do you think Jake will be back with her? Um, it depends on how backed up the unit is. Look, I'd like to talk a little bit more about the delivery. You sound worried. If it's okay, I'd like to fill your abdomen again. Oh! Uh, I'm, I'm sorry. No, it's okay. It's just that it's extremely tender. Kara, talk to me. What do you think this is? I don't know. Something isn't right. You're making me nervous. I discovered some clotted blood just behind the placenta. How much blood? A significant amount, which indicates a clot in the uterus before going into labor. That's why I passed out. Went in the shock from the loss of so much blood. And with your history of hypertension, it's safe to assume that you suffered a Bruptio placenti. But you said the baby looked fine. She did, she does. Yeah, but wouldn't there be signs of neuro damage? A hypoxic event? Your daughter seemed perfectly healthy. Well, how is that? To survive that kind of trauma, I mean, most babies wouldn't. It's nothing short of a miracle. Incoming. Just like I told you, we got ourselves a little honor student here. Is she okay? She, she passed flying colors. Are you kidding me? Are you helping yes. me? Thank you. There you go. Hold on tight. You got it? Uh. They ran another app car. She came in in a solid nine, typed her blood. Guess what? She's got mama's blood. She's O positive. Jake, I'm going to ask you again. Are you sure everything is okay? Sight, hearing? Everything is perfect. Does something happen that I don't know about? Well, apparently it was a closer call than we thought. Dr. Hubbard suffered a placental abruption. It's... Absolutely incredible that the baby is fine. I guess she's just a very lucky little girl. Sorry. We're both lucky. Yeah, I gotta go. Well, congratulations again, okay? She's perfect. Congratulations, you've done good. So, um, <clears throat> somebody want to uh, translate that to me? I mean, what, 
What happened? Non-doctor? <laughs> Before Dr. Hubbard went into labor, the placenta separated from the baby. She began to lose all the life support I was giving her. Your daughter beat incredible odds. <laughs> Jesse, come on. You know, somebody up there was really watching over us. This is really our miracle, baby. Big news tonight, and she has her baby. What? Jesse delivered himself healthy. Wow. Yes. That's fantastic. It's fantastic. Well, tell them congratulations for me. I will indeed, yes. Hold on a second. I just wanted to check on you. Are you, uh, how you doing? You all right? I'm good. You know, relieved that Emma's home. Right. How's that going for you? Well, she thinks that I'm trying to replace Annie, which is not... I just, I just want things to go back to the way they were, you know? Hmm. And they will. They will. I know. It's just a phase, right? And besides... I'm too lovable to hate forever, right? So lovable. Amen to that. Hey, hey how's fine. Angie doing? She's doing great. Healthy uh, delivery, mother and child are fine. I'm so happy for them. Yeah, me too. Yeah, I was just wondering, uh, how are you feeling about being a godparent? You know, I'm just wondering. You up to the task, Miss Martin? I believe I am. How about yourself, Dr. Martin? Uh, yeah, I'm good, I'm good. Personally, I think they're lucky to have us, but mm -hmm. yes. All right, come here. Could have sworn I dropped you off at home. Yeah, thank you. And I, uh, I thought that you were headed back to the yacht club. Uh, restless, I guess. Yeah, me too. Me too. Crazy how we both ended up here. Oh, oh, I can't believe I didn't tell you this. I found a bunch of correspondence from the lawyer handling the probate for Zach's will. And? And the more I went through it, the more confused I got as to why it's taking him so long to settle. Well, time is money. Yes, yes, mm-hmm. Exactly. And I think he's stalling on purpose. So, I'm firing him. Yeah, I'll go ahead and I'll hire a great new replacement. We'll get the ball rolling, we will sell those casinos, and you will have your money for the Miranda Centers in no time. Wow. Yeah, you don't mess around. Nope, I don't. What's the matter? I... I thought you'd be excited. 